Um, really good matchup. What were the initial thoughts on, on Plant and Darrell? Initial thoughts, uh, Darrell has to cut off the ring. Plant is not standing there to get hit. I know people always give him hell for that. Like, all you do is run. Hey, the, the game is to hit and not get hit. So he's definitely going to move. Uh, cut off, can, can Ant Dog cut off the ring? That's my question. If Ant Dog can, and if Caleb, if Caleb stood there in exchange, oh, we, we might have a war on our hands. And I prefer that over Caleb just beating him in a 12-round decision, just boxing from the outside. Uh, I would love to see that, but I think I would love to uh, see a war, but I think Caleb just going to jab him to death and jab him to a victory. But Ant Dog is not coming in there allowing that to happen. I'm, hey, man. Hey, man. I, hey, man. Say it. What? The I hell? might go with the offset. I might go with the offset. Yeah, we you both just got talked the same yourself into name. an upset. Both got the same name. We, I had Michelle, somebody call me Ant Dog before. I knew I forgot. Michelle Rivera also fights. Want to okay. note that as well. Okay, um, okay. I knew there was somebody I was forgetting. That's the Ali guy, right? Yeah. Um, we, what are your initial thoughts there, SP? You're going with the upset, though. Yeah, I like that. I'm going with the upset. This one is um, is 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 really close to the heart to the to the, to the heart for me. Uh, yeah. Obviously, knowing both guys, blah 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 blah. Um, but when I when I take put that aside and I just take take a look at it, um. Is it a 50-50 fight? I think so. Uh, I think the numbers and the activity of both gentlemen will make, will make you side with Caleb Plant. But I do think that Ant has a way of kind of controlling the ring and controlling the fighter and manipulating fighters from time to time. Um, haven't seen that as of late. And I'll go ahead and be open about this. Uh, last time I spoke with, with Ant was couple of months ago when I say, yo, you, in order to win this, you, you gotta, you gotta kind of reinvent yourself. You gotta go back to the, to the, to, to the old school. So you need to go back and do things the way you used to do them. You have to be a young guy in order to, to, to beat Caleb Plant because, and I'm not afraid to say this either, uh, humongous fans of the Darrell brothers, no secret there, but I remember seeing these, these guys, and especially when they turned pro, a young, um, I, what is Caleb playing? I think Caleb's like 28 or, 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 or 30, right, 29, I mean, something I think like that. A couple years younger 28. than me. Yeah. I, I think he's 28. And and I said, you know what? I think that a 28-year-old and dog would, wouldn't have a problem with Caleb playing. So uh, saying all that to say, I think that um, he's he's got to reinvent himself a little bit and kind of just come to the ring young, fresh, and ready to go for that world championship title that he says that he wants to go for. Um, How do you do that? At the end of the day. Well, it's kind of a it's kind of a it's kind of a mental thing as well. I he's been in Florida for some time. No no knock or anything like that at all, but I I was just encouraging him to go back to Flint. Like kind of go back to your grassroots where it all started. Rake some leaves. You I feel see, like I feel like leaf raking <laughs> Midwest stuff. You see that stuff and it kind of becomes a part of you when you get yeah. reminded. You know what I mean? So I think that there's things you can do some of the old school workouts that you may not do anymore. I told I said, "Yo, you got to go." Old and um and not that not that I'm such a big fan of his that I didn't have any encouraging words for for Caleb, but you know I'm just I am, man. Um, I've known those guys for so long that it's hard for me. You know, we ended up on the phone, and yeah. I say, hey, man, um, you know, do this. I'm glad I don't have to rake. That's my takeaway. <laughs> but um, yeah, I, I think it's a I I think you made a good point of I think a, a, I don't want to dis disrespect him by saying he's not in his prime now, but he's he I think he admitted and dog like, is not in his prime yeah, now. However. Yeah. The one thing, the reason why he's called Ant the Dog is because he had dog. this ferocious uh, um, persona, persona, style, he, like, aggressiveness, he, this mentality. He had yeah. a really aggressive mentality. Yeah, you take a look at the animosity that he has towards Caleb. I don't think there's going to be any moment in the ring where he's not going to want to hurt Caleb. And, and as, as long as he's able to make that energy kind of work itself for him, yeah. it'll keep him invested in wanting to win the fight. I had. And, and it'll be interesting. Animosity towards Badu Jack for beating Anthony Durrell. That's how big of an Anthony Durrell fan <laughs> I am, just full disclosure. But um, yeah, yeah, I think I was going to say, I think a young, a younger Anthony Durrell, I would feel more confident just yeah. from, I mean, it kind of is what it is. But yeah, he's, he's going to be tough for Caleb to deal with. I, I, I'm, I may be lean Caleb, but I'm not sure. And the one main reason why I, I feel like Caleb's looking past this guy. You think Caleb so? is looking, I need Canelo again. 
I got to get through Benavides. No, nah, nah. he's got Bradman in his corner. I mean, like, yeah. and let's talk about the other side of that. He's got, Caleb's got Bradman Edwards in his corner now. Bradman is a X's he's and no O's kind of guy. He's, 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 he makes adjustments. He game plans for the fighter. We, this is, this is what we're going to use. You're great at that, but we don't need it for this one. So move. Okay. Yeah. We're not using it. This is what we're using to beat this guy. If something happens in the ring and we need something, boom, we can go to it. You know, he's, that's the kind of guy that, that Bradman is. So I know that they've game plan very well for, uh, for uh, Anthony Durrell, uh, Caleb, you know, just, just having the new baby and everything kind of going the way that he needs it to outside. That's a lot of, of distractions. Course. Well, outside of that loss to, to Canelo, Caleb has always been a very focused and very determined fighter. So I can't imagine. And also I, I even have conversations with, uh, with Mrs. Plant, I'll go ahead and call yeah. Jordan Mrs. Plant, yes. where she was asking me, like, hey, how'd you guys do it? She's really been wanting a baby. So she's not going to allow any of that to get in the way of, of Caleb's goals. You yeah. know what I mean? So the fact that they have that they have had the baby and all this, I think that Caleb is in a very good place. And I, I think it's going to be really good. You say that at the same time, I see my man getting a Twitter war with a... I mean, no disrespect to the dude, but that doesn't matter. It's who he is. You got you to gotta focus. You want to yeah. be a world champ. You, it's ever, who he, you ever seen Floyd Mayweather argue with somebody on Twitter? I, and I'm name dropping my ass off today, but Coach Wade said, hey, I just had to get, I had to get past it. I would come up to Caleb at, at, a, at a training session. Hey, man, I see you doing this, doing that. Let it go. Caleb's like, I, 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 this is who I am. I, this is what, I got to do it. Okay. That's a little different between good and great. Yeah, yeah. Could be. Yeah. yeah. Could be. I, I, I think. And I'm Nidor. I, I was going to say, I'm, let me shut that down. I was yeah, down. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, I, I think. Great plumber, man. I, I think it's. Right. Stuff stitches. Uh, I, think it's gonna, I think it's going to be interesting <laughs> to see because I think Anthony Durrell is a pretty versatile fighter when you look at when you look at it. And so I think that will make it a tougher night for Caleb than maybe some would expect. Like, mm -hmm. oh, Caleb, he's younger. He's this boxer from the outside. He'll just box his ears off and, and move on and do whatever. I think Anthony Durrell has a lot more tools than people realize. Maybe. I think Anthony, he does have tools. I think he's got to use them all. Can't, yeah. leave, can't leave anything in the locker room. Stay mean. And don't be overly aggressive, but be aggressive. Yeah. Even if you aren't punching in Caleb's face, fainting him, and making him feel uncomfortable. If you, if you got an uncomfortable Caleb plant, you got, some, you got something yeah. to, to work with. And is the, is the key for Caleb as simple as just, Box from the outside like you do so well. I <laughs> Caleb, do, Caleb, do what you do. Yeah, because yeah, it, it, it's basically. And always there's there's these fights where it sounds simple. It's like, yeah, just just do that. Caleb like, Plant, just do what you do the best. Hey, Caleb playing against Canelo's. A lot of people say, Anthony, I don't know what the hell you seen. Hey, man, I might have had him up. It was well, hey, it was up till he wasn't. Listen, Caleb's bigger than than at 168 than he's ever been. Yeah, um, stronger at 168 than he's ever been. So while we're saying, hey, box, box, box. It's a it, it, it could be a, a situation where he's boxing, he's yeah. he's moving, and and a counter right hand or a counter check hook puts in, in a in a position where Caleb can, can can take control, and I could see Caleb wanting to do things like that now. Yeah, it'll be interesting. I, I actually think that's a really good co main. Yeah, main uh, event. Hey, happy what birthday, Ant Dog! He turns thirty eight on Friday. Yeah, at the way in thirty eight. I'm, I'm, hey man, chill, chill. That changed your whole decision. Dang. Chill, chill. You getting old too? Okay, yeah. no. You're not. Peter's hand, son of a gun. I don't know. He's just very decisive. Delay reaction no. to your question. You said, does that change <laughs> yeah. your, your, your thought? No, it doesn't. Peter, that was a delay yeah, reaction. Yeah, over here. Uh, yeah. Because uh, I've been on record saying this. Guys, are you're in your prime Longer. closer to 35 yeah. than you are closer to 30. I think boxers so, also are, are, their primes are a little stretched out now. They're able to yeah. stay. So, I mean, once he gets done way in, I'm going to say, happy birthday. Yeah, <laughs> do, I'm gonna do it. Do I'm that. gonna do it. You gonna be there? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I better be there. 